Yalis TF 1A00 TF 1A00 L series shrinking and forming machine has three parts. The first part is steaming and pre-wetting area. The second is drying and forming area, and the third is cooling area. The speed can be adjusted separately according to the requirements of each area, so that the best results that the fabric is processed without tension can be guaranteed. The difference between TF1A00 and TF1A00L is listed as follows: the single segment in the steaming and pre-wetting part of TF1A00 vibrates in that segment. As for TF1A00L, two segments are set in the steaming and pre-wetting part, and both of them vibrate at the same time, which can be used for all kinds of fabrics. The auto electric eyes, which designed for the shelf, used to put on the fabric in the first part of TF 1A00. 1A00 L is to make sure the fabric can be processed without tension. The steaming and pre-wetting area adopts the structure of spraying from the button and drying from the above. Meanwhile, the quantity of steaming can be adjusted from zero to five, with three to four for reference in accordance with the requirements of different fabrics to achieve the best results of pre-wetting for the fabric. The drying and forming area adopts the integrated system with steam heating and electric heating to guarantee the fabric work at a constant temperature. Then the upper and lower conveyor belts will clamp the fabric to dry and form to achieve the best results. An exhaling and inhaling recirculating air system given by four exhauster motors in the cooling area is to make sure the fabric to cool down and formed within a short time. Also, this area is equipped with a device for counting meters to automatically measure the exact length of the fabric after forming. This machine can be used for different kinds of fabrics, including knitting, weaving, denim, chemical fiber, and cotton. Step one: Turn on the power. Step two: Adjust the speed of conveyor belt. The range that can be adjusted is from zero to ten meters. Step three: Set the temperature to one hundred and fifty degrees. Step four: Manually turn on the drain valve. It normally takes three to five minutes before manually turning off the switch. Step five: When the temperature reaches the target, the cooling switch should be turned on. Then turn on the speed of the third part, and the range that can be adjusted is from zero to ten. Turn on the speed of the mesh belt in the first part, and open the steaming valve in the first part, which is normally set to three to four. Turn on the exhauster switch, which can be set from zero to ten, and the speed should be set to three in a normal mode. Turn on the speed of the delivering fabric, which can be set from zero to ten. And should be set to 10 normally. Step six: Start to put the fabric on the machine. Turn on the switch controlled by foot on the left to automatically put the fabric on the machine. Put the foot on the switch of the mesh belt on the right. Adjust the speed of three parts to the same speed to guarantee the fabric can be processed without tension. Step seven. Turn on the cooling switch before leave, and the machine will be turned off automatically after a while. Step eight: Clean the conveyor belts. The cleaning stick will change its direction every four hours, and there are four directions of the cleaning stick, which shall be changed after they finish. Note: When plugging out the upper cleaning stick, make sure the guiding screw is placed upwards. Step nine. Please press the emergency stop button to cut the electricity when an emergency situation occurs, or if some items, which should not be shrunk, run into the machine. Step 10: Clockwise speed the emergency stop button, and the power will be automatically popped up. Thus, the power can be turned on again. <laughs> 